A 31-year-old mother of two from Eben Flow First Nation died Monday after an attempted medical transfer to an ICU in Ontario. It's, it's so, so tragic. It's so tragic for uh, the children uh, that have lost a mother, uh, for a mother who's lost a daughter, uh, a community who's lost one of their sisters, uh, the backbone of, of our communities really. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's, it's a somber point uh, in our communities because of the, just the amount of our people uh, from our First Nations who are currently occupying the IC units here in Manitoba. It's quite unfortunate that, you know, a health system that uh, we pride ourselves on and, and like to say is the best in the world uh, is failing our citizens. The Grand Chief says it's a failure of the province with ICUs in crisis and of Ottawa for not sending help sooner. Shared Health could not speak to specifics but said a patient was identified for transport and destabilized prior to takeoff. The patient was returned to the facility and died the following day. In a statement, Shared Health reads in part, Patients selected for transport to an ICU in another jurisdiction are carefully assessed by the critical care team and detailed discussions occur between the sending and receiving care teams. Rapid deterioration and death of COVID-19 patients requiring critical care is not uncommon and cannot be predicted, whether in the ICU or during transport.